The number one is Exotic Effects XW1. The sleek looking, great sounding Exotic Effects XW1 offers a huge range to produce smooth and shallow vintage sweeps all the way up to top long and wide sweeps, so there aren't many sounds it can't accomplish. Also, its treble and bass controls are extremely responsive. This product is available on Amazon for $236. There are 60 customers have reviewed this product, the average rating is 4.6 stars, a customer said. I really couldn't ask for more in a wah pedal. Flexible sound and smooth mechanics. The smaller size is definitely noticeable, but it's charming and quite beautifully crafted, plus, I've come to appreciate that the extra bulk of traditional waz is really unnecessary. Another happy customer said. Best wa out there. Although a bit pricey, I would say it's worth it. By far, the most complete, best sounding wa I've ever played. A little smaller footprint than your traditional crybaby, with more control. The second product in our list is Vox V845. The Vox V845 is an inexpensive model that won't make you feel like you've sacrificed sound just to save a few bucks, especially once you hear its balanced dynamics and rich tones. It excels in the low-end frequencies, retaining clarity even with added distortion. The price approximately $69. There are 450 reviews which average rating is 4.2 stars for this product, a customer said. Feels very durable and has a wide tone range. Can also take a 9V battery instead of the cable which comes in handy. The next one is. Fulltone Clyde Deluxe. There is no doubt that the Fulltone Clyde Deluxe is pricey, but it has a solid build and three unique tone effects, shaft, jimmy, and whacked. Overall, the entire unit feels very polished and the pedal action is smooth right out of the box with the perfect resistance. The price is around $224, check out the product link in the YouTube. This product is rated with 4.6 stars from 18 customer reviews, a customer said. I spent a lot of time researching different wah pedals. I was going for the that classic Jimmy voodoo child tone, so naturally the first place I looked was at the Dunlop signature Jimi Hendrix pedal, dot but it didn't get very good reviews and most people said that it doesn't sound anywhere close to Jimmy's actual tone. I came across the full tone styled deluxe and it got great reviews and I loved the tone I heard from it on YouTube videos, so I went for it. The packaging is nothing fancy, nothing more than a white cardboard box, dot but you will notice how. Another happy customer said. After doing a lot of online research I decided to take the plunge and grab this pedal. I had heard that it doesn't play nice with other pedals and that it generates a lot of noise. But I generally play rock, so, controlled, noise is kinda what I'm after. When I plugged the pedal in I was a little less than impressed with the sound. There wasn't any noise when the wah was turned off, but there was some when it was engaged. I played with the knobs a little and was able to minimize the noise and get some incredible. The next one is Dunlop CAE MIC 404. The Adept Pedal Tech can wrench an incredible variety of tones from the Dunlop CAE MC 404 because it is so customizable. Its dual fossil inductors each have a different level of resistance, which allows you to switch between two distinct voices quickly while performing. The price is around $170, check out the product link in the YouTube description below. This product has average 4.6 stars from more than 62 customer reviews, a customer said. I am in love with this pedal. It is very versatile. There are some knobs on the inside, one for each mode. I dialed in the perfect tone for my guitar setting on one mode and my bass guitar setting on the other. This has a permanent place on my pedal board. In fact if I were to only have one effect it would be this. 
if I could only have two, I would add my big muff nano. Another happy customer said, I love this WA. Plain and simple. Having two WA inductor options along with the boost knob and an on off indicator is literally everything that has been missing from any other WA I've ever owned. I have an older Buddha WA and there's nothing wrong with it, but I'll never look back. This is just a modern update to a classic piece of guitar history, machinery. Should have purchased it years ago. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below, so if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.